Hello, good morning, friends. Uh, this is my first ever video from a public location like this. Uh, I am at Lucknow Airport boarding a flight to Bangalore for one of my classes, which I unfortunately could not cancel. Uh, in the dilemma since past two days, whether to go, not go, go, not go, finally made up my mind uh, to leave. As we can see, there is very little uh, movement at the airport. Uh, people are wearing masks everywhere due to this corona crisis that is happening. Uh, we are preparing ourselves against the uh, infection from the outside by taking all the cautions, uh, you know, from the masks, uh, hand sanitizer, staying indoors, everywhere else, whatever. The possibilities of having any virus infection is everywhere around in the air. So maybe not corona, but something else. Today's video is just to understand uh, how to overall boost your immunity against any such elements which may be also perhaps in future may affect us in the similar outbreak which, which uh, you know which can break out like this so let's understand the mental health aspects how you can remain strong and immune to such uh, infections even in future for that matter but first talking about corona coronavirus is affecting uh, you know in three major ways uh, to all of us so the first aspect is as it is entering through your, uh, you know, uh, breathing. It stays in your throat for up to three days is what the medical health professionals are saying. So what is throat about? It's about self-expression, self-esteem. Any of, uh, you know, those individuals who are feeling terribly vulnerable, even with the degree of masks, uh, you know, all the cautions that you're taking, how, how much paranoid you're feeling about the infections uh, coming to you? How much is the fear? you know that it might hit me I might get affected so the first layer of mental health work that uh, we all need to do is about dealing with the vulnerability element uh, within our mental health space how vulnerable am I feeling if there is greater fear and paranoia about it just simply sit calm down uh, and breathe it out so that you are actually feeling safe wherever you are otherwise you are nowhere safe even at your own home there might be something that might uh, you know affect you so the first aspect is working on the vulnerability element within us from the vulnerability moving on to the self-expression which is where the throat comes into the play there's a very important energy center around your throat which is called Vishuddhi Chakra which is responsible for our self-esteem and self-expression if we are expressing all our thoughts fearlessly or perhaps if not then uh, you know develop a habit of writing it down in a diary and breathe out whatever the discomfort on daily basis that we are going through now that will keep your throat very very strong uh, and immune to any such infections entering because so the coronavirus is coming into the throat and stays there for up to three days uh, before it moves down to the lungs is what the mental health professionals is what the medical health professionals have said it uh, while uh, having an interaction with the doctor from there when it is affecting your lungs the third element the most important one where it is about breathing how uh, you know easy or difficult we feel our life is uh, because breath represents life the life that we are living now in that case whatever is that element in which we are feeling vulnerable plus the degree of self-expression that is missing and how much of a struggle that we're feeling that we're going through in our life. These are the three major aspects, uh, you know, through which you can be immune to such an infection in a mental health perspective. If all the three aspects of these are taken care of, for sure, with everything around, you're going to be safe with the virus. And uh, even if you get infected, the recovery is going to be uh, faster, better. Stay indoors, stay safe and work on your mental health. Any, any other aspects, please watch my videos on breathing technique. How to breathe out any discomfort from your space just through your thought. Uh, how to perhaps open your meridians and uh, meditate upon positive thoughts. Stay home, make the best out of this time that you've got it for yourself. Spend some wonderful moments with your family. Have a wonderful day. Signing off, Rajesh Singh from Happiness Solutions. Thank you very much.